patapos na yung came to answer so we're going to talk about our experience as key influencers Welcome to our pajama night out. We're going to talk about our experience as key influencers. How do you get to know the K Influencer Academy and what made you decide to join? Okay. Singgo para sa akin kasi nag-join ako para Napadaan lang siya sa feed ko. Actually, I don't have any idea what this game, the venture is. And hindi ako ganun ka-active sa YouTube. Mm-mm. Na-discover ko siya sa KCC page. Ay, oo. oo. Follower oo. din kasi ako ng KCC. Oo, doon ko siya nakita. Tapos sabi ko, ah, try ko nga mag-join. Um, I get to know K-Influencer Academy last year pa. Mm-hmm. But... I wasn't able to join kasi nalaman ko siya, nag-start na sila. So, close na yung application. And mm-hmm. I had a friend na K-Friends din. It's another community. Uh, we act as online ambassador of Korea. So, we tend to share a lot of Korean cultures din and share mostly about the Korean places that we could visit. So we were able to parang ini introduce namin siya online. And then we get to know her and we had a GC and then we exchange YouTube channels sa mga my channel. And then When I saw her channel, nakita ko doon about yung content niya for key influencer. So nag-asa ko, ate, saan ka ba nag-apply for the key influencer? And ano ba siya? Ano ba yung key influencer? Tapos sabi niya, in-explain naman niya doon. Tapos yung mission ata niya noon is about the similarities of Korean culture and Filipino culture. Yun yung na 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 napanood ko which mm-hmm. which actually I became curious after na sayang hindi ko na hindi ako naka, nakasali so sabi ko ate uh, yearly ba siya or like pwede, pwede pa bang sumali next year kaya mm-hmm. ayun inabangan ko siya at the end of 2020 inabangan ko kung mag 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 announce ba for 2021. And Mm-mm. fortunately, nag-announce naman. So, I gave Mm-mm. it a try. As a cake influencer, marami tayong mission na nagawa. Oh, every, oh. Wait, every fairness, month. galing natin. Oh, ang dami na palang mission nun. Tingo, ano yung best mission or best, um, para best team na nagustuhan mo during kay influencer? Actually, every mission naman is very sentimental for me. Kasi first time ko talagang nagawa yun, every mission. Unlike dun sa optional na isa na hindi ko talaga nagawa kasi hindi ko talaga siya nag-gets. But I was really happy from the start. Pero kung meron man akong pipiliin sa, la- sa lahat ng missions na nagawa ko is of course of course the first na pinaka nagustuhan ko is yung July mission yun ah. yung the Korea that I experienced kasi yeah. diba as someone na hindi pa nakakapunta ng Korea that place really has a special um special place in my heart kasi 
the first time na dumalaw kami doon was because of a project in college. Mm. So this this uh, I was ta- I am talking about the July mission, the Korea that I experienced in Suban Korean restaurant. So grabe yung sentimental na na parang memory ko doon kasi first thing na na interview namin yung may-ari noon. Kasi yung project namin na gagawin is like a Chris TV type. Yung parang, oh. yeah, Chris TV. <laughs> Tapos ma- interview. nag-interview kami sa may-ari, which is he gladly accepted. And <clears throat> first time ko din makita na parang nakatok na Korean. Like yung Korean talaga. <clears throat> And then... The the good thing is also um yun yung first na Korean restaurant na na napagkainan ko. Plus it's also yung pinagkain namin doon, wala kaming binayaran. Like totally free. Yeah. Oh, dahil sa interview. Oo. And grabe yung may-ari and tsaka yung customer service nila. And then yung interior design din, para ka talagang nasa hanok. And remember I told you na gusto ko talaga yung mga traditional vibes and settings. Oo. So pag nakikita <laughs> ko talaga ko. yung mga hanok, yung mga hanbok, I really fell in love. Yung parang mm, madali akong ma-inlove sa mga traditional settings. Kaya ko naman yung chingo. Sabi, ano naman yun sa'yo? <laughs> Siguro, ang ano, ang una kong masasabi, July mission din. Same with oh. Jingo, July mission. Yung, ang ano no kasi, how Filipino view, mm. um, Korea here in the Philippines, parang, Uh-oh. it's like sharing my culture and at the same time, comparing it to Filipino culture. You know, the fact na, you can experience Korea in your own country. Mm-mm. Yun. Kahit hindi ka pa nakakapunta rin, you can experience the Korea on your own, in your own country. And that's the thing na sobrang-sobrang nagustuhan ko i-share sa mga uh, viewers. Yeah. All right. So, um, let's talk about the best things um, being part of K-Influencer Academy. Best so, things. what what do you think are the best things that uh, you were able to do or you were able to achieve uh, mm-hmm. when you were or when you will or I mean when you became a mm-hmm. part of the or member of the K influencer? Influencer. Oh, for me, singgu. And dami, and dami kasi nag-open opportunity when you join when I joined. Okay, influencer. Sobra parang I did not expect to learn a lot of things and grow up as a uh, content creator. Oh, kasi um sobrang nakakasimula ko lang din mag-YouTube ngayong uh, ngayong taon. Although I do love editing, I do love to uh, take a lot of videos, a lot of photos, pero I never post anything. Ang na-practice ko as influencer is yung pagharap sa camera. <laughs> sobrang, sobrang, sobrang hindi ko alam kung paano ko i-express yung sarili ko sa camera. Mm-hmm. Parang nakakahiya. Lalo na sa labas. Mm-hmm. Kaya sobrang favorite ko yung July mission, guys. Um, in K-influencer is, um, is give me a lot of uh, Self confidence mm. to promote, to share my works, um, to stand in front of the camera. Tapos yan mga editing, mga marketing. Malamig ka matututo na talaga guys sa kay influencer. Ang best things ko talaga ng nagustuhan sa kay influencer is meeting someone with the same passion. Katulad yan si Singu. How about you, Singu? Takan yon. Yeah, I actually agree. Kasi mostly mm-hmm. Um, nagiging active lang din ako talaga sa YouTube when I joined K Influencer. That's right, yes. Kasi before, mostly, um, I really wanted to start a YouTube um, channel. But mostly kasi, 
you know, if nakikita nyo yung mga before na mga contents ko, it's more on, uh, no, 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 not Korean really, but more on song covers talaga ako. Kasi I really Hi. love singing. Mm-hmm. So, gusto ko talaga mag, mag-record ng mga songs. But, minsan kasi, nakakapago din mag-edit. Kaya gusto ko talaga yung songs. Kasi, maliit lang talaga yung intro. Kasi kailangan mo na mag- magkanta. So, <laughs> yung true. editing, okay lang. Smooth lang. Three minutes editing. lang. Oo. Ganyan lang. Oo. Unlike if, mag-create ka ng mga contents, kailangan mo pang pagandahin para naman manood talaga yung viewers na Pero parang from finish, finish to, I mean, from start to finish talaga na manunood. Parang retention din sa mga subscribers mo. Um, I, uh, I mean, aside from the workshop itself, yung workshop natin, session talaga yung how to, to edit, how to yes, adjust uh-oh. the pictures, mga ganyan. Mm-hmm. And, dahil ako sa kay influencer na tuto mag Adobe Premiere. <laughs> oh, oh. Buti ka <laughs> pa na ano, nakapag Adobe na. Ako oh. hindi pa ako nakapag Adobe. Pero marami ako natutunan sa CapCut kasi mostly CapCut yung ginagamit ko. Of course, one of the best things that happened also was when I when I was able to join the mentoring program, just like si sinabi ko kanina, Chingo, I didn't expect it to, to be able to join. Kasi ang dami pala talagang nag-sign up. But to yes. think na dalawa lang yung napili from the second generation, which means sa, sa time natin ngayon. Um, ano mga advice mo sa mga future kay influencer na gusto mag-join in the next um application 2022 well for me uh first thing na gusto kong ipa paalala sa inyo if you wanted to become a member of a K, of the K influencer academy under koreanet and ocis <laughs> yes yes uh uh um yes. ano lang you just need to love what you do talaga. And if you really love to share your passion about Korean culture, then go for it. Baliwala sa kanila kung maliit man yung channel mo or if you are already a big channel, um, channel then that's good. But even if you are not really that big, like us, we started not really big. I think I started like 105 subscribers, I think. Mm-hmm. You know, diba? currently you are already in 200 plus. Yes, I started and hindi ako masyadong nagko-content talaga. Parang it's because of the passion that I have that... I really wanted to share to my viewers and to the world what I I love about Korea, why did I fell in love with Korea, and what are the cultures that I love about the about the country. Plus, if you wanted to to become also a member of the K Influencer Academy, being a quitter must be not in your vocabulary. Kasi yes. pag nag quit ka, like, after one mission, nagsasiyang ka ng oras mo. Mm-hmm. Kasi, you wasted that first mission na natapos mo. Tapos magsa-stop ka lang. Mm-hmm. So, that's why, um, just like what we talked about a while ago with Shingo chan na there are times that we actually almost give up but we choose to stay and because we chose to to love what we do we were able yeah. to come up until at this very moment how about you Shingo? 
Ako singgo, my advice to the next K influencer next year is like what Singo said, you have a um, passion on it. Kasi if wala kang passion sa Korea, hindi mo masarong gusto yung Korean culture, tas yung pag edit pag-create ng content, hindi ka magtatagal as content creator. Yes. You will easily to give up. Parang, you don't have a, determine, a determination to go on to your work. Parang sayang yung time. So, yes. you must need a great passion on it and sobrang-sobra talagang determinado ka na sumali sa ganitong industry. And, I'm sure pag sumali kayo dito, sobrang marami kayo matututunan like what we experienced this year. Thank you so much and Yeah, thank you for tuning in with us. And if you guys like this vlog, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Share! Yes! Thank you so much. Our channel is on the description box. Yeah, you can see Yes. And follow my Shingo channel. Yes, Risha, Opi- Risha Dizon Official. Follow her channel. Yes. yes. And my chingo also. Simply Chan A. A. Ayon. Thank you, guys. Gal Jayo. Anyo. Gal Jayo. Tunog na tayo, chingo. <laughs> <laughs>